Hey everyone, this is Squallsnake from MyGamer.com and today I am playing Fishing Adventure on Xbox One. Let's jump in. And it looks like Poland is the only area available because this game was actually made by a Polish company, Ultimate Games. And Poland has several major rivers and hundreds of lakes forming the components of its complex fresh water bodies. The largest and properly best known river of Poland is the Wisla? Warla? Bug? That's weird. Alright, whatever. Let's jump right in. And this is the Xbox One version. And I actually reviewed and played this game on... Switch. It came out on Switch a while ago. And I don't even really remember even playing this game. So let's just hit the X button. Throw it out there, it seems. You can follow me on Twitter, by the way, at Zach Gaz. Z A C K G A Z. Reel it in a little bit. And. I had a bite, I think. Take. I don't know what take means. Okay, you guys, you gotta snag them. Now I'm reeling them in. I think. Oh, I got something. I got a roach. You can use buy stuff, or you can keep it for experience points. I'm gonna keep this one for experience points, and then so it's kind of a, a, a give and take system because you need experience points. Like once you're level three, you unlock the level three items. But then you need money to buy the level 3 items. You know, better rods, reels, things like that. Alright, I'm going to throw this out there. What I didn't like... It's, it's kind of coming back to me now while I'm playing this. What I don't like is there is not a underwater view. Like, you're just playing as this first-person fisherman. It would be cool if there was, like, an underwater view so you can see if there's any fish around. Rotate the camera around. There's none of that in this game. But the RPG features where you level up and stuff, that's kind of cool. All right, I want to get to level 2. So I'm going to hit B again and I'll just release it. All right, let's walk around the lake. There was a boat back there. I don't know if you saw that or not. You can actually get in that boat and you can drive around, which is kind of cool. What do you think? There's going to be fish by the trees? Let's try the trees. If it doesn't even let you, it won't let you. So, if you can see in the upper right hand corner, I need 300 experience points to get to the next level. I'm about halfway there. Gotta watch the little bobber icon at the top. Anything? Nothing? Very chill, no music. The music in the main menu, however, there we go. The music in the main menu, I don't know if you heard that right when I started the stream, is really good for like no reason. It doesn't need to be that good, but it is. All right, so I'm going to keep this um, four points short. All right, so I do want to level up. I think, I don't know what that means. So if I'm clicking in the stick, oh, I guess I can't go that way. Oh yeah, so there's a nice invisible wall right here. Okay. Uh, I don't know what the deep. I'm hitting the D-pad. I don't know what this screen means. Maybe eventually you get new stuff and you can swap. You can sprint. There we go. I'm holding down the left trigger to sprint. Yeah, I'm not going to get in the boat. I want to go over here. See how big this level is. Let's throw something by the island. What do you say? Let's cast it far. All right. 14 meters. So I did change in the option menu from meters to feet, but it still seems like that specific distance measurement on the left is in meters. Okay, I got nothing here. I'm going to reel this in a little bit. Oh, there we go. Oh, I missed it. There we go. 
got them. Let's see what we get. There doesn't seem to be any... Yeah, I'm just holding down the trigger. Like, it doesn't seem to... You know, if you press it too much, you're going to break the line or anything like that. This is a bleak. I don't think I've ever heard of a bleak fish before, but I am not a fisherman. All right. So, I'm level two. Can we go in the house? What's in the house? Well, what's up with this flower? Oh, there's a pond over here. Let's fish in the pond. There we go. Secret pond. Maybe we'll catch a frog. Tadpole. go got something 12 meters away yeah this is in meters too on the screen new personal record of a roach all right so I got the roach I'll sell this one I'm gonna hit the okay oh this is just the options I'm gonna hit the other button there we go so this is where you can buy stuff so all right so this is like 1,999, but I got to be level 6, and I only have a 1,000 bucks anyway. So it's not looking like I can buy a new rod until I reach level 5. Reels, level 3. Oh, different lines. Here we go. Different lines. You got hooks. Bunch of different floats. And here's the bait. I'm sure this is got okay, it tells you what you can catch here. Roaches, chubs, bleaks, and so on. A cherry. You can fish with cherries? I didn't know that was even a thing. What is this? A liver? Gross. Oh man, green peas. What fish like green peas? Chubs, breams? Oh, the peacock bass love eating liver. That's pretty gross. Here's a fly. Lures. Alright, you can get a bunch of lures. And it doesn't look like really... Yeah, level 3. And here's equipment. Oh, this is how you just equip stuff, I guess. Alright. Okay, interesting. Alright, I'm going to cast it again here in the pond. Get a little closer. Let's see what we get. Fishing adventure. Are we on a fishing adventure? According to the game, we are. Oh, it's hopping out of the water, and we got a chub. Yeah, chub. All right, I'm going to get the experience points. Let's check out this house, though. It doesn't seem like we can go in it. There's a fence. Somebody likes to fence off their house. And, yep, here's the invisible wall. Oh, I walked through that tree. That was cool. Alright, that's fine. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Alright, I'm stuck again. I cannot walk this way. Is this another invisible wall here? That's weird. Yeah. Alright, let's go to the big pond again and throw one out there. What do you say? Throw a deep... lives in that huge mansion in the back. So it seems like you just kind of wait and you'll eventually get a fish. I don't really think I've had a cast where I haven't caught a fish yet. So it keeps things moving at a quick rate. And look at that thing dancing on the line. All right, we will release it and take the experience. We've got to get the 600 points to level up. And let's throw it out here, see if we can catch another one. Sure we can. So if I hit the bumpers, looks like you can adjust the tension of the line, I guess, left bumper and right bumper. It's weird that it says take. I think that might be a, like a translation translation issue versus like 
set the hook, or s maybe it should say set. Take is kind of weird. Unless that is a fishing term, what do I know? I'm not a fisherman by any means. And what's on the line this time? Another chub. All right, let's hit B and release it. We want that experience. Maybe a couple more. Yeah, from the options screen there, you can pimp out your rod and your reel and your line and your bait. But what you can't do is you cannot change your outfit or modify your character, which is fine because you can't see them because this is a first-person game. Doesn't seem to be an option to go to third person, which again is totally fine. So I'm just glad they didn't add useless features. So yeah, not exactly... A simulation, but not exactly arcadey either. I think it's kind of like awkwardly in the middle. These 2D rods, reeds, reeds are like in the way. I do know this game is in many different languages, so that's got to be why it says take. Again, European made. I'll get out of here. This weed is in my way. Alright, throw it out there, see what we get. And the last one didn't give me a lot of experience. There's only like about a dozen achievements in this game, too. I do write for a site called mygamer.com writing for the site for, man, almost like two decades, I think, at this point. Why didn't that one set? So if you like anything about games, I try to cover games that nobody else is covering. Write about them all the time. Try to stream them when I can. Make a bunch of videos. Give me a subscribe on YouTube as well. And, all right, 50 points. All right, so maybe like two more from now. I'm open. Get to level three. Maybe I should take the boat out. Maybe I'll take the boat. You know what? I'm going to reel this in and take the boat out real quick. Let's try that. Because I remember when I played the Switch version, I want to say maybe the boat had like weird controls or something. There was something up with the boat. I don't remember what it was. It's been a while. And how do we... All right. Oh, you got to buy the license. That's what it is. So I could buy this thing for a hundred bucks, or I could get a lifetime license. That's another reason to catch more fish. I'm going to buy this just so I can hop in. And, oh, that's what it is. You got a row. It's so weird. Like, you can't really see where you're going. And, all right, so there we go. So now I'm off. And let's try. Yeah, so weird. All right, so I'm pushing forward right now, which is making me go backwards. And the, if I hit the other analog stick, I think I'm trying to just spin around so I can see where the hell I'm going. Like, you can't... That's what it is. All right, so at least I'm turning. This is all with the left stick, by the way. There's nothing to do with the right stick, which is weird. All right, I'm going to hit A, and now I can cast... All right, so I'm going to cast maybe closer to that log out there and see what happens. Yeah, you got to wait for it to be all the way down. If you kind of do it early, you won't snag the fish. And well, that was a little bit bigger. Man, only 26... So this is a small one. So this is six bucks or 54 experience. All right, so I'll just take the experience because that doesn't seem... Six bucks is like nothing. I just paid a hundred bucks to get the stupid boat. All right, can we catch another... 
big bleak. Let's see. No, missed it. Got it. So can I get about 40 experience points to level up to three? What did I get? A roach. And... There we go. Boom, level three. Press any button to close. All right. So let's... Can I go... I don't want to go back. I want to go forward. Can I go forward? No. So, yeah, you can't really see where you're going. That's what's weird about the boat. Like, I'd like to try and go to the other side, but now i got to, like, awkwardly turn around. Let's, I mean, I'll give it a shot. Let's try it. Let's, so I'm going to hit... I'm holding right. All right, now I'm going to hit up. All right, so I'm just going to, like, keep holding up. Maybe I'll go a little bit to the left. All right, there we go. Now I'm going to just keep holding it this way until I hit something. Let's see what happens. How long is this going to take? That is a bad camera movement. I'm going to throw up all over myself because it, like, bobs like that. Holy cow. It's still raining. Oh, I just missed the log. Just missed the log. Wow. A big lake here in Poland. I wonder where the invisible wall is going to be here on the other side. Oh man, that is a bad camera movement. I can't take this anymore. I'm going to hit A. And where was I going? Oh, I was almost to the other side. Alright, so let's chuck one out that way. Oh, that was a bad cast. That was dumb. Let me try that one more time. Alright. Closer to the shore. Reel it in just a little. Oh, I missed it. And... Come on. There we go. Got him. Got something. Another roach. Release. So I'm going to hit B. Oh, I can't get out. Okay, so I was hoping that would, like, teleport me back. Yeah, if I'm hitting B, you can see there. So, wow, this sucks. So i got to, like, go all the way back to get out of the boat? I don't even know if that's going to be possible, because you can't aim. So, yeah, stay away from the, <laughs> from the rowboat, maybe, if you can. And... Yeah, a little weird. But, I mean, I think it's a chill game. It's nothing special. I think the RPG mechanics are kind of cool. It's going to take you a while to unlock the good stuff or get to anything else. But, you know, again, not simulation, not quite simulation, but not arcade either. But, yeah, I'm going to, oh, I'm right at the shoreline now. Anyway, but I'm going to call it here. So let's see if I can I'm gonna go back. So that was Poland. Oh yeah, and then you can real quick, you can play this quest mode. If you didn't want to just play that free play mode where, you know, here you got to catch five fish in ten minutes. Here you have to catch five fish with, you know, over three pounds and so on. So there's all these, you got Germany, France, Norway, Canada, United States, Haiti. But you got to get a license, so you probably have to complete these five to get these next five, for example. Or, oh, 200 bucks. Oh, so you got to spend 200 bucks. Uh, oh, that's the reward, I'm sorry. So that's the reward. But anyway, so there's a little bit of extra game in here. 
outside of the standard play quest mode. But yeah, this is Fishing Adventure. You can follow me on Twitter at ZachGaz, Z-A-C-K-G-A-Z. Please go check out MyGamer.com. Check out my personal blog at Squallsnake.com. And until next time, thank you for watching and game on. You know what, I'm going to let this menu music just chill for an extra minute. I'm not going to say anything. This is the end of the stream, but just enjoy this outstandingly good for no reason menu music. And thank you, give me a follow, and I'll catch you next time.